Hey guys, how are you? Welcome to April. This is uh, happy birthday, Aries. This is um, your reading for April. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If this doesn't resonate with you, check out your rising or moon sign or your Venus sign. Bring me messages for those watching, the subscribers, those watching. Um, if you hadn't had a chance, we, I have done some three-month abundance uh, forecast and three-month um, love forecast, and you can find those um, uh, videos on the links below. All right, they're taking you to one page in Vimeo with all of the videos. You can choose from them, okay? All right, guys, let's see what's going on for you. Aries, this has required a lot of shuffling of me. Oh, that's a bad thing. Just saying. Just saying. Okay. Let's see what's going on here. Aries, okay, things balancing out. I like that. We just went through that Libra uh, full moon. Uh, the autum uh, autumnal, the vernal, no, the vernal equinox where we're getting into spring, night, equal night and day. That's what equinox means. Equal night, equal day. And things are starting to balance out. That Libra energy in that Libra full moon feels, felt like good balance to me. Aries, uh, I feel like you're indulging yourself and in going toward the person you want to be with. A little bit of indulgence here. Yeah, you could be connected to um, an earth sign or a Gemini or a Gemini that has some groundedness to them. They've been taking your breadcrumbs for a while, Aries. This is about to blow up into full on love. Oh my God. Aries, this is going to transform. Wow, you could be uh, you could be going towards a Scorpio, but it feels more like um, this connection. Okay, so this is you here, in and out of someone's life. Well, don't go anywhere, Scorpio. In and out of someone's life here, really being kind of self indulgent, like doing the thing you want to do. Okay, you're sort of, but the universe is like, hey, you know what? This is your person. The universe is, is trying to wake you up, reconnect you, reconcile you, anything with re. That's what's going on, too, in the Mercury retrograde. Reunion, um, reconnection, reconciliation, okay? This could be a past life situation. You've been dipping in and out of this person's life, and now it's time to be balanced, okay? Now it's time to be balanced. This is the person who's been kind of taking your breadcrumbs for a while. Queen of Pentacles. Um, you're not really giving them anything of any sort. Okay, you're sort of just doing it when you want to do it. You're being a good partner when you want to be. Uh, but something happens. Tower. Two of Cups. Death. So a couple things here. For some of you, because this is for the relationship, for some of you, um, a sudden, excuse me, a sudden choice is made. This Queen of Pentacles makes a sudden choice to move towards love. Could be with a Scorpio. Boom, over, game over. Okay, you've been stringing this person along, Aries, for a while. Or they could have been stringing you along for a while. And all of a sudden, it's not all of a sudden, though. Okay, you got me? So what's the tower here? Three of swords. Page of swords. Emperor, there you are, Aries. So this feels to me like you... You might stumble upon some information... And this person, um, it blows up. You could get your heart broken by this person. You thought that they were always going to be around for you. And they fell in love with somebody else. I feel like you're getting what you want, though, in the sense that you're not really responsible. This 
Knight of Wands is sort of not being responsible to anything. This is um, Sag energy, though. They could be in and out of your life. Bam, they fall in love with somebody. It gets more balanced here. Tower and Death and the Two of Cups in the middle. This Queen of Pentacles, um, they make a decision. They've been agonizing over this decision. Chariot, they want to move forward. Ten of Pentacles toward a, a stable life, toward a... Um, a relationship with husband, with a husband or wife or a spouse, and you've kind of been dragging them along for a while, and they find somebody. I feel like they find somebody. I feel like, Aries, this could be you. You find somebody, and bam, that other person's out of the picture. Whatever it is, it happens fast, okay? This thing has been going on for a long time where you guys are sort of like not really... Um, together. This could happen over the course of the spring into, into the summer, but when it happens, bam, it's going to happen fast. Okay. You got me. So you might not see it moving along until one day you just wake up and that person's gone. One day you wake up, fall in love with somebody else. Boom. It's over. All right. It happens fast. This is going to happen fast. All right. Let's see where we go with this Aries. We're going to do the rest of April. Um, extended with this other deck. Let's see where we go. All right, Aries, um, link is below for your extended. I'll see you over there.